I've tried a few times to sketch a heart shape, but as it turns out, I'm just not an artist. It always looked wrong somehow. So I watched a few videos on YouTube and finally found one where the artist likes to use a compass and a ruler to get things just so. Now we're talking. It turns out it's all a matter of proportions and I can deal with that. In the part workbench, create a sketch on the XY plane. Start with an arc. Place the center on the X axis. Start the arc on the Y axis and bring it around until it's just below the X axis. It doesn't matter exactly where. Create a construction line. Start it on the X axis to the left of the Y axis and end it on the center of the arc. Before we get too far, set the radius of the arc to 20 millimeters and name it size. Set the length of the construction line to constraints.size times 1.5. Select the endpoints of the line and the origin and constrain it symmetrical. On the left endpoint of the construction line, create another arc. Start it coincident with the end of the first arc and bring it around until it's somewhere below the x axis. Again, it doesn't matter where. Set the two arcs to be of equal radius. Using the polyline tool, connect from the lower end of the left hand arc, place a point below on the y axis, and then up to the right hand arc. Set the vertical distance of the point formed in the V-shape and the center of the right-hand arc. Make it constraints.size times 2.25. We're just about there. Make the arms of the V-shape tangent to the ends of the arcs and there we have it, a perfect heart shape. One nice thing about this sketch, because everything is constrained based on the radius of the first arc named size, we can make this sketch any size we want in the data pane. Just set the size constraint. This will come in handy in a future video. Thank you for watching. If you liked this video or found it useful, please like, subscribe, and share. If there's anything you'd like to see covered here, please let me know in the comments below.